Hello everyone, welcome to a UR Reach Academic Overview. My name is Jordan Emmerfall and I'm the Academic Coordinator here at the UI Reach Program. Today we'll do a flyover of the UI Reach Academic Experience for our students while they are here on campus. We'll give a glimpse of what our core philosophies are and also the different experiences and supports that are available to students while they are here in the program. Here you'll see a rundown of the different core philosophy areas that we have or, or strands within our UI Reach coursework. Quite often all of our courses will hit on all five of these, uh, or sometimes there may be a course that is specific to one or two, and we'll run through the specific courses here in a moment. But just to give you an idea of where the, the roots of our core curriculum come from, uh, it can be found in any of these five areas here. You'll also note that at the bottom we have uh, the, other, the other big component of our program is the integrated coursework opportunity for students here on campus that allows students to explore different interests, uh, pursue academic goals, and or get a feel for what some of the academic integrated experience can be here on campus. So here's an outline of what a typical course sequence might look like for most UI REACH students. Not all of our students will follow this same progression. Uh, but the majority of our students take the, if you look at the different cohort breakdowns here, take the majority of the classes that are listed under each year. So as you look through these, you'll notice that there are some themes or um, course sequences that are hit in each of the years. So early on, we're hitting on transition to campus, computer skills that students need here on campus, um, personal finance, so these are, these are all applied skills that students will use, not only here, but applied skills that can be then started to build on for the years to come while on campus, but then also beyond the campus as they get ready for independent living and life on their own. You'll notice that the amount of programming starts to curtail as they get into years two, three, and four. That is because students are beginning their internship in years two and continuing into year three and four. So that will be a big component of their day, Monday through Friday. And in addition to that, we also wanna provide more opportunity for students to tailor their schedule to their specific goals and interests. And you'll see at the bottom there, we have courses that are available each year. Quite often we'll have students that will take courses from this list all of the years, but sometimes they may only take a class like social skills in the first two years and then choose to move on to different opportunities here within the UI Reach program or with an integrated course opportunity later on. And so like I said, these this is just an outline and while some students may follow this pretty closely, some students may choose to just hit the core components and build out the rest of their schedule with some of these electives here or integrated course opportunities here on campus. You can find on our UI Reach website, if you go to the academics page, you will see an outline of all of the classes that students can take and more specifics there on that website about what each of these courses includes. So just a few uh, quick hitters on what our classes look like here within the UI Reach program. Uh, they're all taught by a team of dedicated and qualified UI Reach instructors. Uh, our class sizes vary from anywhere between six and eight students for some of our smaller uh, reading or academic skill building classes up to we have some classes that are full cohort and so we may have between 20 and 25 students in there. Down at the bottom you'll see that we have a few different ways to support students in classes. We have UI Reach Academic Associates, which are hired undergrad or graduate students, usually with uh, disability support or academic backgrounds that are able to support our students in classes. We have volunteers from the College of Education that are pursuing their teacher education certification. And we also have practicum students or interns that may be involved in the classes as well. Usually we'll have anywhere between one or two, sometimes up to three, four or five in-class uh, student staff supports that are available to support students during the learning time here at their UI Reach class. 
Uh, within each class, we have a cross-curricular focus. So as I mentioned, the, the idea here is that all of our skills are applied and that they are focused on how students can generalize the skills or apply their learning to their everyday life. We deliver instruction through UDL, so that's Universal Design for Learning. And the philosophy there is that we are not only delivering or providing content in diverse ways that all learners can access, but also measuring student learning in a way that is fair and valid for students as we assess how our instruction is being effective and where to uh, supplement, support, and build on the growth that students are making during their time here. We have uh, differentiated course sections, and so our, depending on the course, we have sometimes between two and four sections in which students are split into different groups, usually by ability level, so that instruction and support can be tailored specifically to that group of students and the level that they are currently at. A couple of basics here on course policies. Uh, the, sh the short version here is that if students show up and do their work, and attempt, you know, do their best, then they will pass the class and they need to attend at least 70% of classes or and or complete 70% of the class assignments. We have a lot of other notes here down below. All students on campus, whether it be in the UI Reach class or in an integrated class, are expected to follow all the rules and regulations of the university uh, and the Iowa Code of Student Life. Students here on campus also have a great opportunity to enroll in integrated coursework. Students are able to audit UI classes in addition to their UI, UI Reach coursework. Our students have the same access to classes as all other students on campus, or the same, the same rules, I suppose you could say, in that they, they have access to any course that does not have a prerequisite or a required college enrollment. So for example, a student wouldn't be able to take a law class or a business class unless they're in the law or business school. Uh, just the same as any other student here on campus. Uh, but that, because it is such a huge campus, there are still thousands and thousands of classes that are open to any and all students here on campus. And we have a, a great partnership with the UI, Reach, U, UI Academic Advising Department who can help students explore those courses as well as our internal academic support team. Uh, we strongly recommend that all students register with Student Disability Services. That provides not only accommodations for students while they're in those courses, but also priority registration as they are looking at and registering for different courses. It puts them at the front of the line uh, for all students here on campus. We work with staff and faculty on providing a learning experience that is specific to that student. Uh, if, this, if the student is auditing the course, we'll work on the student with specific modified course learning goals. Note here that students are all held to the same behavioral expectations as UI, UI students. So all, as I mentioned earlier, any student enrolled in an integrated course has the same behavioral expectations. And if additional supports are needed, we will work with that student and their support team on discussing what the appropriate choices there are for that student and course opportunities and supports that may be available for them. Students do have the opportunity to take classes for credit. So if a student has a goal or a, is exploring academic opportunity uh, here at the university or beyond uh, UI Reach, they can take classes for credit that are transferable out of the university or to a degree seeking program. Just to note that if students do take courses for credit, we can provide the regular SDS accommodations and uh, some support here as a program, but other modifications or supports that aren't available for other students on campus would not apply here. So essentially the, the rules are the same for our students as they would be any other student if a student is, is taking a class for credit. What are some of the learning supports here for students on campus? We have, as I mentioned earlier, we have a great partnership with the Academic Advising Department and they can provide guidance and support all students explore that, that wide catalog of classes that is available for students here. We have a liaison there that will meet with our students and or our academic support teams to help students as they are exploring classes to register for. We do provide some academic support for students, not only for work they are completing here with their UI Reach classes, but also if they are in an integrated class, 
we have an hour a week of a learning lab where students can receive support on their homework, you know, guidance on checking grades, looking at the syllabus, looking at the schedule and being prepared for, for whatever is coming up in their class. Uh, and that's one hour a week. Anything beyond that would be the responsibility of the student and uh, their support team to finance or, or arrange. We can help find where the supports might be on campus. So you'll see down there at the bottom, there's Tudor at Iowa. Uh, some of those services are free, but they might be also specific to a, uh, a certain class here on campus. Uh, but quite often, anything beyond that would be a, a paid tutoring service. Student Disability Services, as mentioned, we recommend that all of our students apply with them. Uh, and you can find all the information you need on SDS. Uh, we have a link on our website, or you can uh, just Google Student Disability Services at UIowa. We have integrated academic associate support. So given the, the type of class and the amount of need that a student may have, we do have one-to-one -one in class support opportunities available. Uh, it's not for all students necessarily or, or multiple classes, but it is depending on the case-by-case -case basis, we may determine that that would be an appropriate support in that situation. Of course, when students are enrolled, uh, all students have an academic student support team member. And any of the things we've gone over today, there'll be opportunity to explore it more detail and uh, specific to uh, this, each student while they're here. Well, that does it for our overview today. That was a, a quick overview of what students will experience and the supports we have here. Like I said, more, more information can be found on our website and there's opportunity to explore uh, the different components of the program and the supports and experiences that are available to students while they're here. If you have any questions, you can reach out to me. Uh, my email is jordan emerfall at uiwa.edu. Or if your student is incoming or enrolled, you can contact their academic support member and they will be able to give you more specific answers that will guide you in the right direction uh, with your students as you prepare for their experience. Thank you. Take care.